Hello, Josh Powers here with Quixel, and today I'm excited to go over the brand new Unreal 4 Live Link plugin for Megascans Bridge. The plugin has been rewritten from scratch to ensure optimal performance and ease of use. It fully supports Mac and Linux, and there are some new and improved features such as scatter, LOD, and specular workflow support. So let's begin by installing the LiveLink plugin so that Bridge and Unreal can talk to each other. To install, you can simply click on an asset you've downloaded and go to the Export Settings tab. On the Export To dropdown, select Unreal Engine and then click on the Download Plugin button. Installing the plugin is the same as before. First, select the engine version you're using from the drop down menu. Then you'll want to set the installation folder by going to the Unreal Engine install directory, then go into Engine, Plugins, and then select Folder. And the plugin is now installed. You can also set a specific folder to export to, but we'll just leave this blank. And now we're ready to hop over to Unreal. The first thing we'll want to do is click on the Megascans icon to open up the settings window. The first setting is Auto Populate Foliage Painter. Checking this will automatically deploy scatter specific assets to the Foliage Painter tool so that you can start painting down the details right away. Next, you can enable LODs to be applied to your import, which is very helpful for your scene's performance. Bridge allows you to batch export numerous assets into Unreal with just one click. However, this can take a little while to do, especially if you're exporting a significant amount of assets at once. So with this setting enabled, a warning will pop up whenever you batch export more than 10 assets to ensure you're not tying up your machine with a large import when you don't intend to. If you want to enable displacement support for the material, make sure this box is checked. Apply to selection allows you to import a surface from Bridge and automatically apply it to the mesh or brush you have selected. And Import Master Material Textures allows you to bring in the texture maps from Bridge without a material. This can be useful if your project has specific material creation pipelines where you only need texture maps and not the master materials created by LiveLink. And if you're already using a custom made master material for your project, you can easily override the LiveLink master materials by assigning your own to the material slots here. That way, whenever you import a new asset into your project, they'll utilize your custom master materials instead of the default ones. And lastly, we can quickly create material blends simply by giving the material a name, setting the destination path, and then selecting multiple materials from the content browser. And then all we need to do is hit the Create Material Blend button, and you'll have a blend material to throw into your meshes. Now all that's left to do is import an asset, which is very easy. All you need to do is go back to Bridge, Click on one of your downloaded assets, double check the export settings are to your liking, and then hit export. Unreal automatically imports the assets based on the settings you applied, and in seconds you're ready to place your Megascans asset into your project. Through LiveLink, Megascans Bridge and Unreal work harmoniously together to help eliminate some of the tedious technical tasks that artists face every day allowing you to stay in the zone and focus your energy on making breathtaking scenes. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.